What's going on YouTube? Junior Mob here. Welcome back to Junior Mob Gaming and we are back on what remains of Edith Finch. Um, just to let you know, I know this is not the room we uh, left off in. I'm sorry about that guys. I started recording and the recording just messed up and I started in uh, her room and then basically what all we did is that we went out this window. Not, not, we didn't go out this. We came in through this window. We went out the other window, went across the terrace and then came through this window. All right. Nothing, you know, abnormal or different, anything like that. Um, as you all know, Molly was crazy. Yeah, imagining freaking monsters and eating folk and all that kind of stuff. Something's wrong with that chick. I don't know, but something's equally as wrong with the grandmother Edith. Um, you didn't miss much. All she said is that she uh, spent most of her time in this room. Uh, she said that um, over here... When Edie told people Sven was killed by a dragon, she could also have said he was building a dragon-shaped slide that collapsed. She yeah, she... But she didn't. Yeah, she basically uh, said that. So, yeah, um, her husband was killed by a freaking toy dragon. I don't know how that happens. This family's jacked up. They just need to hide somewhere, okay? They just need to hide. So, sorry, guys. Without further ado, let's get into this fully. So, I don't know if... I, I showed this in the other recording that jacked up, but look at this, guys. A freaking bird memorial. Look, look at the names. Look at this. Zerpy. Purply. Lurpy. I mean, seriously, I, I, are you guys noticing the trend? Because I am. But then we got Rob. What the heck? Edie knit me a new pair of gloves every year, just in time to replace the old ones. Oh, well, at least that's one normal grandmother like thing. All right. What else is over here? Oh, and then I was going through. The room is like a museum. Was going through this little thing right here show you guys that for 500 years the finches have been famous throughout norway for their fortune and misfortune yep family's Odin jacked buries the latest victims of the family curse his wife ingeborg and their newborn son johan oh wait okay here we January go 7th, oh, 1937 who? he set sail with his family and his house hoping to leave the curse behind how do you sail your house? That is pretty cool though, I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> Forty foot waves off the coast of Washington send the house and Odin to the bottom of the sea. <laughs> That's why you don't sell your house, people. You don't do that. Odin you sell your house but not sail. With husband Sven and baby Molly step ashore on their new home, Orcas Island. Hmm, wonder what happened to them. Odin Finch is the first to be buried in the new family cemetery. Okay, this is crazy. His daughter Edie is already dreaming of a new Finch house. Hmm, okay. All right, and that's it. A horribly sad kaleidoscope, people. Whatever's wrong with this family, it goes back a long ways. You ain't lying. I'm just wondering how you' about to go. Uh, let's see. Oh, we're saving. Louis Achievement. A week before we left, but Edie had already started to memorialize him. Yeah, she memorializes everybody. Okay, what the world? What's, hey, everything done over here? Oh, what's this? Edie gave a big interview about a mole man living under the Finch house. My mom was furious. Okay, I promise y'all right now, there better not be no mole person under this house. The recording will be over. <laughs> y'all think I'm playing. Wait, is that a people? Oh, it's a, it's a bit tall. Okay. We sure as get out. But yeah, there better not be no mole man. I ain't ready for no mole man. Nope. Even in her 90s, sometimes Edie seemed a lot younger than my mother. <laughs> yeah, because she was crazy. Crazy old keep you young. Sam's first wife, Kay, left on the house was the pink bathroom. Seriously, guys. I said this in the last recording. Trace. If she interrupts me one more time, or am I interrupting her? <laughs> Either way, who put shag carpeting in the bathroom? This is not sanitary. Y'all know there's pee all in this area. You see me? All in this area. There is pee. I'm telling y'all. 
keyhole. There's a secret in this bathroom. Oh, I wonder what that could mean. Oh. There we go. I couldn't turn it, y'all. Yep, There's pull it open. There's a secret in this bathroom. It's in the last place you would look. It isn't in oh. the cupboard. It's hidden in this book. Oh, that was clever. <laughs> what? Okay, that was clever. That was cool. Sven gave Sam an old camera he'd refurbished. He never put it down. Okay. That's nice. It's the most normal thing you guys have said. Um, I think that's it over here. Oh, shoot. From the paintings on the wall, it was clear my brother Milton had been here before me. Oh, okay. And some, oh, someone's getting a swerve on down here, people. <laughs> someone's getting a swerve on. All right, move it out of the way. Uh. Let's see. Can I get up now? Here we go. What's going on over here? Can I break this? Nope, I can't cross it. Uh, we gonna walk up these steps. We walked up these little steps. Okay, this is an interesting little bedroom. Hmm, nothing really to interact with here. Sam had a twin. Did you now? And that he never talked about him. Mm, okay. A lot of us have siblings we want to talk about. Like history any more than my mom did. <laughs> they the command center seriously. Yeah, an imagination. I want to remember my brother, by Sam Finch. The thing I remember is that when he made up his mind, that was it. Oh, we on the beach. Oh, he even broke his leg. What stupid thing have you done? Oh, I have to do both. Oh. Another mushroom, and he did. Oh no! Bet you wish you had that mushroom. <laughs> At Barbara's funeral, he swore he'd never be afraid again, and he wasn't. Hmm. Okay. So he's brave. Kevin always wanted to fly. Oh no! We about to do something we shouldn't. But that day, he finally made up his mind to do it. Uh-oh. We about to go somewhere, y'all. Going around was impossible. Woo! Uh. Oh, we we going a little too far, y'all. Ah, reach! We about to go around the tree. Uh. Maybe if the wind hadn't picked up. Oh my gosh. Let's do it. Ah, oh, not quite. Bring it back down. We're going to do this, y'all. And maybe we can still be here. Ah. Come on. Come on. Oh, this is hard. Get it. I think he'd already made up his mind. Oh, we almost there. We are almost there. That's what I want to remember about my brother. Oh, man. Okay, this is harder than it looks, guys. Yeah. Oh, we did it. Oh, we did it. Oh, we overdid it. We way overdid it. Oh. And he did. Okay. Calvin's story felt strangely familiar. When I was younger, I remember trying to do the exact same thing. We all did. We straight all did. And we never could. And probably for good reason, because y'all know he drowned, right? He's talking about, oh, he flew. Edie roped off Calvin's half of the room. Oh, and you just disrespected it. Sam enlisted at 18 and never set foot in the room again. 
Well, girl, you was all disrespectful about it. I mean, you just walked over there like, like, ha. Huh? What the world? Oh, that's vicious right there. Okay. Your family has some secrets. Yeah, they're trying to be all cute and nice about it. Oh, he flew away. Yeah, he flew right into the ocean and drowned. The passages were a pretty tight fit. They'd obviously been built for smaller hands and bellies. This was built for a lush. Look at this, guys. Somebody was getting drunk on the regular. Yeah, dog. I had a feeling like this, I'd probably be drinking too. <laughs> yeah, all right, where we at? I always thought of Barbara as a child star. Hmm. I never thought about how hard it must have been for her afterwards. It's hard for every child star. Why do you think they go nuts? Lose their mind. Start taking drugs and <laughs> showing they buy all kinds of they behind. Y'all know what I'm talking about. I ain't gonna name no names. As if I have to. <laughs> of all the stories people wrote about Barbara's death, I'm surprised Edie saved this one. Uh oh. Oh, no. Nah. Oh, Jack here with another ghastly tale inspired by America's most unfortunate family. I'm calling it the surprise ending of Barbara Finch. Uh... A child star, Barbara was famous for her scream. Oh, okay. She was all washed up. I has been. Dang! But in a lucky break, she'd been asked to perform her signature scream at a local convention for monster movie fans. It was just the boost her career had needed. 1960, yeah, though. Unfortunately, her scream hadn't aged well. <laughs> oh, no. Nah. I think you just need the right motivation. Her biggest fan and current boyfriend, Rick, was about to demonstrate when Somebody one more person yelling in my ear. That was a great scream. It was Barbara's father, Sven. He'd slipped into a table saw and had to be rushed to the emergency room. So Barbara got stuck babysitting her youngest brother Walter. Her convention comeback was cancelled. Oh, okay. I'm hearing frustration, but I'm not hearing terror. What if I tried? A gang of hoodlums and Halloween masks have been terrorizing Orcas Island tonight. Police are urging residents to. Uh, oh, shoot. You're right. Also, I loved your delivery on that. Why is your baby. What is the Scooby Doo? Because my dad likes making puzzles and secret passages. There's a key hidden in the music box. The secret is to keep winding and winding until finally the key pops out. Thanks, babe. I'll be back in a sec. Oh, that's a that's for me. That's for me to do. Three minutes later, Rick hadn't returned. So oh. Barbara went to look for him. Right on cue. Never date a finch girl, y'all. They get you killed. She reached for the music box. Oh, I'm part of it. Found the key. She listened for Rick, but the house was silent. I'm officially a comic book character. Oh no, I don't want to. No, I don't want to. Yeah, and the lights went. Oh, come on. What? She oh. Rick scratch and imagine the worst. Who comes down here with a crutch? I'm calling the police. What you mean? Oh, blood on the thing. Yep. Who wants to get? Ah. Who wants to get whipped? Who wants to get? Ah. Uh, practicing. I'm practicing. Ah. I'm practicing on everything I see. 
Ah, ah. Let's see if I can play pool. Uh. Ah, yeah. Boom! <laughs> Smack. Come on. Ooh. God dang it, y'all scratched. All right, never mind. Let's go do this. I think I got enough practice in. They don't want it. Ah, uh, they don't want it. Clear the table. Smack this door open. What? No, 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 no. The gang's leader is the infamous huh? man killer, Dr. Carl Hamill, who impaled and then ate his family ten years ago tonight. I'm sorry, he did what? Well, okay, sorry. I don't care if he's my boyfriend or not. We out. I'm going back up these steps. <sighs> okay, I can't be no punk about it. I can't be no punk about it. We ain't gonna be no punk about it. Man, this music's going. There's a pinata. Beat this pin yada up. Don't you move. Don't you move and touch me. What's on? That's the saw he done hurt himself on. Oh. Da. Da, da, da. Ugh. oh, it's pitch black in here. Oh, no. No, no, no. Oh, it's rattled and grew steel. I I'm ready for you. I'm totally ready for you. Yeah. Get a practice swing in. Let's do this. Ooh! Oh! You shouldn't have played. Barb, relax. I was just trying to scare you to help you find your scream. Well, and instead, you got busted. Scared, Rick. I'm furious. Then act furious. All I'm getting from you now is that you're hurt and confused and you're. Out. But she kept a little something to remember him by. Barb, have you seen my other crutch? And she was still holding it when she fell asleep watching the late, late picture show. <laughs> That's what she get for playing. Barbara! Walter, what's going on up there? Ah! Okay, I'm coming up. Oh, no. Shoot, just ask her boyfriend. He got swatted with that crutch. What you mean? Oh boy, we back at it. Why is this swinging by itself? Whatever. Ah. Ah, y'all ain't gonna let me vandalize the house? Okay. Oh my gosh. You better not move. Don't you move. I'm not playing with you. If Walter's playing... If Walter's playing, he's getting beat. Worse than, than her boyfriend did. Okay. I don't even know which way his room is. Oh, I can't go this way. So they made it easy for me. Okay. Uh. Walter, stop playing. Well, I can't look left or right. Okay, Walter. Walter, you gonna get beat? Oh. Police describe the man as six feet tall with a steel hook for a hand. Residents are urged to lock all doors and windows and notify the police of any suspicious activity. Bruh. No. No, 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 no. Swing. And swing. He was quite. Nope. Nope. Uh, take it. Bah. I know what you did last summer. He couldn't get enough. <laughs> There's gotta be another way out of here. We must be fine. Uh oh yes it is. Come on with it. Let's do this. Oh hold up. We played our part beautifully. I think we can see why we can't get enough of Barbara. No, I'm just playing. This is serious. Okay. Oh he's behind this door. Oh, okay. Window. She thought about abandoning Walter. But just couldn't do it. Uh, I can. I can think about it just fine. Oh. This is totally I know what you did last summer. He can't be killed. Oh. I got you. Ah. Yeah. Oh. He wasn't moving. Ooh. She sensed the story might not. Over. Jump on his head and beat him to death. Oh. 
Can I can I go follow him? Oh, I don't want to turn my back. Oh, this is not good. Girl, you gotta get down these steps quicker. I know you're working with a lot of in the back, but seriously. He's gone. He's totally gone. Yep. Where he at though? It vanished. She listened for his breathing. But all she oh, gosh. heard was. <laughs> this is not a good time. Please leave. I have a crutch. I will beat anybody who's playing. Oh gosh. Was coming from inside the house. I'm sorry, what? Turn around, turn around, turn around, turn around. Oh dear. What you mean, oh dear? Swing! Surprise! Oh. People play too much. The monsters had come to surprise her. For Barbara, it was a dream come true. What? And she saw what kind of monsters they were, and she realized what was about to happen. I'm so confused on what's happening. Barbara Finch gave a performance of her life. She gonna scream, is she? Oh! I myself, but I hear Barbara was magnificent. Poor girl. She had a taste for stardom. But unfortunately, so did her fans. Of course, the police blamed it all on poor Rick. Oh. He disappeared the same night. And little Walter? Hiding under his bed the whole time. Walter, you oh, punk. Hard. But that's another story. As for Barbara, tucked inside the music box is all they ever found of her. Tucked inside the... Oh, wow. A real eerie tale. Boy, you better get out of here with that joke. You better get out of here with that laugh, too. What the world? Oh, my gosh. And then they got the ear on the back cover. Okay, worst story out of... Uh, oh, my gosh. To be remembered, as absurd as that comic was. Maybe what Edie saw was a happy ending. Uh, Edie need help, just like Molly. That's the worst one. I prefer Molly and Cal what happened to Molly and Calvin. And Walter deserves whatever he gets. He's gonna let his sister die like that. I don't care what happens to Walter. Woo. Okay. All right. Wait, wait. wait. Do I see something else glowing? Oh my gosh, that was crazy. You know what, guys? I just thought of something. Maybe I'm stupid for this, but Bar Barbara and she was with Walter. That was her brother, Barbara Walters. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, I guess I have to sneak back through here. I guess now I know why mom didn't like me playing with the music box. No kidding. Oh, we can get out through here. Because there's a freaking ear in it. What the heck? I thought I opened that uh, music box. Oh man, this house is jacked. I played with the music box and never found the basement key. Here's my thing. These are all just stories, but if the music box thing is true, how much else is true, you know? Okay. If I find an ear in here, guys, I don't even want to talk about it. You turn and it's a bow, that key. All right, well, the ear's not in there anymore. Oh, the basement. And it's saving. All right, guys, so I'm going to leave it here because the basement, I, I, don't, I don't do basements. 
you know, you feel me? I just don't do basements. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I think this is a good place to stop the uh, video here, guys. I hope you guys are enjoying this game. This is actually pretty interesting. Not a whole lot of jump scares and stuff like that. But speaking of jump scares and stuff, I don't know if this game has jump scares. But I was thinking about doing that game Little Monsters, I think it's called. Um, it's like 3D-ish looking. Uh, I saw like Rad Brad do it and uh, gamers like that. And um, thought my, maybe I'll check it out. Uh, let me know in the comments below if that's something you'd like me to try. Um, other than that, of course, I'm going to keep going with this series, but um, I'll start on that too. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Uh, put a, a hit out on that like button for me, all right? Because I, you know, I think I'm doing pretty good. I think I'm doing all right. Uh, if you didn't like it, that's cool too. Uh, make sure you subscribe and join the Junior Mob family if you haven't already. Because, you know, who doesn't want to be a mobster? Okay, it's every kid's dream. You know what I'm saying? All right, and I will see you guys in the next video. Junior Mob out. Peace.